been celebrating Christmas for far too long, but now nobody can tell me I'm wrong. Today we are making personalized Christmas cards. They could be Christmas tags, they could really just be a Christmas treat. Basically we're just gonna make something that has someone's name on it. So do what you want with it. The recipe that I'm looking at calls for a third of a cup, but we're gonna half it because half yourself. A merry little Christmas and maybe not an obesity problem. I'm giving you the gift of self-control. You're welcome, you don't have to return it because I'll never have any. Half of a third. You did it. Large saucepan. How large is large? We're going to melt the butter. God, it's not that I was too excited to make this. I was floored. Be hot. What am I doing? Oh, butter melts pretty fast. Did you know? Hey, did you know that? Butter melts really fast, so you should probably wrap it up. While the butter is melting, prepare two cups of marshmallows. We did it, they're prepared. Now put the two cups of prepared marshmallows inside of the pot. Food coloring, half a teaspoon of green food coloring. I feel like when I wear this sweater, I just automatically am just hunching over. This sweater adds 40 years to my life. You are my sunshine. I feel like everything's gonna happen from this point. Melting, melting. Seems kind of like a lot, but okay. It's very green in here. I'm nervous. Can you tell? Three cups of cornflakes. You're making a Rice Krispie treat essentially, except for with cornflakes. Beat the clock, beat the clock. This doesn't look right. Feels like there's not enough marshmallows. I can't tell if it's the brushing, the pressure, or the actual stove, but I am sweating right now. I feel like this needs to be hotter. Okay, now it's burning. I just feel like it's not, it's not the right thing. It's not right. I'm gonna add a little bit more of everything. Is it smoky in here? A little bit more butter. I feel like I'm doing it ER. This is an emergency. Putting more marshmallows in. How many? <laughs> oh gosh, now it's burning. <sighs> My smoke line's probably gonna go off. Okay. Take a breath. You're good, you're good now. The hectic part is over. We're in December. The hectic part, AKA January through November, also whatever just happened there, is over. We're in the Christmas spirit. We're going to make tiny little wreaths. Take a little bit of the mixture and put it in a circle. making a lot of these when I was only gonna make one card. Some people have more than one friend and that's why I'm doing this for you. Lucky you. That was just me mocking you. I have more than one friend. I have two. Now that you have a wreath of a sort, we're going to add in little berries, which are gonna be played by the role of M&Ms. I'm hoping there's some red M&Ms in here, and if they're not, that's not very good. We're gonna find red M&Ms. Oh, what do you know, they don't stick. <laughs> no worry, that's where white icing comes into play. Put three little M&Ms on each wreath. For the actual card, we need graham crackers. I wish there was a way to make this stickier. What's a sticky substance? Okay, white icing is not working for the adhesive, so we're going to melt some more marshmallows and make that be the sticky thing. We're doing good, but we got to act quickly. So, use your brain and your agility and go. Put this on the back of this and then you do that and then that and then maybe a little bit of that and then stick it on there. Please work. So, so now that your wreath cards have cooled, you're going to write the name in this tiny little spot, so I hope you don't have any friends that have any name that has more than three letters in it, because they're not getting one of these. Good news is that the hard part is behind us. Bad news is that I don't have all the proper things to do this next part. Usually people have a little tip to write. I do not. So I'm gonna do my best to fabricate one. This won't work, but let's give it a shot. I'm gonna fold this into a lot. Take a side of it and roll it up so that it has a cone shape. Here's the thing, tape it together. Oh, it's falling apart. Okay, we're moving on. That's a bad idea. We're gonna go with another option called a sandwich bag. Put this in here, make it go. Snip off the tiniest little edge of the sandwich bag. We're gonna make it really broad in general to where you can give this gift to anyone. We're just gonna write, you, because it's gonna go to you, whoever receives it. And there you have it. These are your personalized Christmas card tag things. So, check this out.